Would you believe me if I told you I wasn't looking at the camera right now? I'm actually looking away from the camera. So what magic is going on? I'm using the new AI eye contact correction feature. It's available on Descript and V.io. So is it creepy? I thought it would be, but I'm pleased with the results. And I'm going to show you how to use it on Descript and V.io. Now, you've probably clicked on this video because you want to use a tool like this to help you make a better connection with your audience so that hopefully they buy what you're selling. But here's the truth. Even if you have fantastic eye contact, they're still not going to buy what you're selling if you're not clear on your offer. That's something I can help with. As an entrepreneur, I started my own spa business and I was able to scale it to be over $1 million in revenue because of my unique offer. If you want to learn more about creating and implementing a unique offer so your business can grow to seven figures in revenue, stay till the end where I'll share more about my five-step process for creating irresistible offers and one-on-one -on -one guidance. To use the eye contact feature on V.io, you need to have a paid account. So after you've set up your paid account, go to your dashboard and on the left-hand side, you will see new video. Let's click on that. Then create project. Click on that. Hit upload your video. You go to upload a file. Here's my test video. I'm going to upload it. Now, as long as you're paying money to use the eye contact feature, you might as well use v.io as your main video editor, but you don't need to. You could just pay for one of the paid plans and just use it for the eye contact feature. Okay, now that the video is uploaded, you can see I'm not looking directly at the camera. Not at all. Okay, to enable the eye contact feature, click on the video, and you're going to see now here on the left, the eye contact feature is available. So select the feature. It's going to start processing. It may take a little time for processing. So I'm just going to fast forward to the end. Okay, it's done now. It actually did not take very long. It took about a minute. Now, you can see I'm looking absolutely dead on at the camera. Now I'm going to go back here and I'm going to turn off the eye contact feature so you can quickly see the difference. Now I'm looking away from the camera. Now I'm going to turn it on again. Now I'm looking at the camera. Now it does adjust my eyes a little. It takes away some of the reflection from the ring light I'm using. And my impression is it makes my eyes a little bit darker in color, but I like it. I think it looks pretty good. Now you could just click done over here on the upper right and then export. Okay. So now you could go to export your video and quality is standard. You could actually go to the advanced settings and you could go to 1080p quality I, and then export, which I'm not going to do right now. Okay, we're done here. We're going to go to Descript next. With Descript, you do not need a paid account to use the eye contact feature. However, because it's a free account, it will take more time to process than V.io. After you sign up for the free account, go to your dashboard, and then you're going to see projects on the left-hand navigation. When you select that, you're going to come to this projects page here, and you can see a lot of my previous projects. When you want to start on a project, you go way to the right here and click, oops, let's move this, click on uh, the, the new button, and then on video project. Okay, it's opening it up. And then where it says to add your file, go ahead and upload your file. Okay, here's a te the test video that I'm going to upload. Okay, so when you attempt to upload your video, it needs to transcribe your script first, and that's what this box is asking to do. So select the transcribe button. That starts the transcription process here in the upper left hand, but it is asking if we want to change the language it transcribes and we're going to keep that English. Okay, you can see we're up to 50%. Now we're up to 83%. So we're going to be done in just a second. By the way, both Veed and Descript are really good video editors in that they let you edit your video like a Word document. Okay.
Once the transcription is complete, we're going to do the eye contact parts. You just click once on your video image and a bunch of navigation options open up on the right-hand side here. When you go to the effect selection and click on it, you can see eye contact is down here at the bottom of the menu. Select the eye contact feature and it will start to process. So sometimes it could take a long time. We'll get it started. I find that the results are virtually the same between Descript and V.io. I'm just going to leave here and conclude the Descript portion. Now in the past, when I used the eye contact feature on both of these platforms, sometimes there would be a glitch where it looked like the eye contact paused for a millisecond. So if this happens to you, all you have to do is use some B-roll or text to cover your image for a second or two. Let me know how this works out for you using this feature. Please share your results with me in the comments. I'd really love to know. I've created a five-step process that I use with my clients to guide them in creating irresistible offers for their business. I've helped grow the revenue of large companies like AT&T and Virgin Mobile and five startups during my career using this exact process. Now, for a limited time, I'm offering a free coaching call to three entrepreneurs who are interested in one-on-one -on -one guidance to help them create their own unique offer. You can apply by using the link in the description. Thanks so much for watching.